Yo, what's going on? Hope all is well. I'm Duke. And I'm Chanel. And welcome, welcome to our, to our channel. channel. So today we have a really special and fun video for you guys. Just another way for you all to get to know us a little bit more and see how well we know each other. I hear that, I hear that. Now, if you are a new subscriber, stop what you're doing right now. Let us know where you're from in the comments, one. Yes. And while you're at it, make sure you subscribe so you're always up to date with all of our posts and all of our episodes. And if you're not a new subscriber, then that means you're family. So, welcome back. What's up, CD fam? Yes. I know that we have been like, putting it out there that we're looking for a YouTube family name, and I think that CD fam sounds good. Duke is not in love with it. I'm kind of impartial to it. I like it, but I don't love it. I don't love it. But for now, if the missus wants it, the missus gets it. Listen, I think CD Fam is cool, it's straightforward, but if you guys have better names, feel free to throw them in the comments right now as well. But what are we getting into today? So Thanks. check it out, man. Today, we are doing our first ever couples quiz, Chanel and Duke edition. Yes. Now, over the past, I don't know, year or two, we've been seeing uh, different couples doing their uh, GQ couples quiz, mm -hmm. and we thought to ourselves, man, that's pretty dope, and you know, we want to do it, so mm -hmm. here we are. Right. Yeah, I think it's just a fun, it's really fun because, you know, you're with your partner for some time and you just, sometimes you, there's little details that you forget. And so this is a good way for me to refresh his memory about some things about me and vice versa. Yeah. And also for us to share with you guys what we like and just who we are. It's kind of interesting because I really wanted to know how well does she know me? I personally think that I know her better than she knows me. Oh, okay, so we doing that already? So I think we should make a wager. All right, so we're about to do this couples quiz, right? And in her hand right now, show them the card, show them the card. You guys, we did our little thing thing with these cards. Well, Duke did. <laughs> <laughs> Put our logo on it, and behind these cards are some really juicy questions. Not, not, ju not juicy. No, nah, they're not juicy. They're really simple, surface like, level yeah, surface level questions. Um, and if you have watched the GQ quiz before, I'm pretty sure you guys know what you're about to anticipate, but this yeah. is our edition of it. So, until, until GQ hits us until up. Until GQ hits us up. Are you guys tired of doing uh, knockoffs? <laughs> no, nah, but so I think the wager is, which one, let's see, we'll see. I think if I end up getting more questions right, that she gets, then I'm going to need, I need you to cook seven days straight. What you want me to do what? I want her to cook seven days straight. That's a, that's a fair way to do it. I gotta cook it or can, can I provide no, the you food? Need to, you need to cook it. You need to go get the groceries. You need to cook, prep, all Good that. Child. Right. If I lose. If you lose. Okay. I want that Chanel bag that I've been. What <laughs> the brakes? I mean, Christmas is right around the corner, darling. What the brakes? How's cooking Chanel bag? <laughs> Listen, that, that, nobody crazy. told you to choose that's true. that. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. Okay. Okay. Fair. Okay. You don't gotta drop the bag, but just CC me. You know, CC me, <laughs> and not an email. <laughs> so, are you ready? I'm ready, I'm ready. What age was I when I got my first sewing machine? 10. Correct. Okay, what is my favorite Jamaican dish? Aki sawfish. Correct. <laughs> okay, let me switch this up a little bit. What is my favorite way to unwind after a long, hectic day? Watching a movie with me laying up. She can't keep her head off my chest, y'all. Okay, why are you, did you Did you watch me when I was writing these answers? No, I just know you. Okay, okay. What outfit was I wearing when we first met? You were wearing um, a crop top. 
first of all, let's just get that out way. You had a crop top on. <laughs> That's not hard. And you had a, a white and black crop top, and you had some shiny leggings. <laughs> <laughs> Chanel, Chanel used to wear shiny leggings all the time. So I mean, I pretty much still do, but yeah, but she used to wear shiny leggings out. <laughs> now, now she wears them in the gym. But back, back when I first met her, it was just like I did, like shiny leggings. Like I she did. Out what is my favorite meal to cook for you? Um, uh, steak, steak. And what else? Uh, potato. Okay. Correct. Steak, baked potato, and veggies. There you go. Yes. Ding! Ding! <laughs> what was my first tattoo? Uh, Queen Abitiri. Okay. On the back of your neck. Okay, so that's right. But I'm going to throw a little twist in here. Hold on. What? I get that point. You get that point. Okay. That's, that's a point. Okay. But we're going to do a little bit of a bonus. Okay. A bonus. What age was I? when I first got that tattoo. Bonus questions to give you two additional points. Um, 16. Yes. <sighs> Why are you so good at this? <laughs> okay, not nervous. What is my biggest pet peeve that I have with you? Dishes. Leaving, leaving the dishes in the sink and not washing it immediately. Mm. Or putting them into the dishwasher. Um, I'm gonna say that's no point. What is it? When you leave the dish sponge in the sink. That's not the same. We already discovered, okay, hold up, no, 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 no. We already discovered in our household, Duke does not wash the dishes. It, it's actually great if I can get him to even put the dishes in the dishwasher. So I do the dishes, hold but, on, but don't, I don't get that point though. No, you don't. I don't get how. Jamie, point. does he it's, get the point? Wait, Jamie. You just say dishes. I said dishes, right? This sponge. I said, I said, I said, leaving the dishes in the sink. It's part of the whole process. A half, I guess, a half. All right, you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna, I'm gonna take this half point right now. But if you're watching this right now, you're once you, so once, once you guys see this half point, cheater. I want y'all to let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments if I deserve that extra half point to complete my point? Or do I, or do I deserve nothing at all? Go ahead. Wow, right get Right now, right now. I need all my points. This is a bet, this is a wager. Okay, no, but I, that's fair. We'll leave it up to you guys to decide if Duke gets a full point for that. But for now, that's a half a point. But I do have a bonus on top of that, so you may be able to bonus redeem yourself. Down. That's what they do on the quizzes. Okay. And, and that's what we're doing here. What's something that you do that I love every time? Kissing your forehead. <laughs> That's one of them. That's not what I was thinking. Uh, but you didn't, you didn't realize that. That's one of them, right? That's one of them. Kissing your forehead. Okay. Can I get that? You get that. So the next one is, what high school did I go to? This is so easy. Um. School of Fashion Design. No, you have Fashion to, Institute. You actually have to say it in the I right order. Fashion okay. Design. Fashion School of Design. You want one more try? <laughs> Before you lose this point? Come on. Okay, you get the point. Don't, but it is, is it? the High School of Fashion Industry. The High School of Fashion Industry. HSFI. Yeah, I definitely gotta get that point. Yeah, you get it, you get it. I'm just being difficult because you get every all the answers. So I know you guys know Chanel has a fashion background, right? Hold up, it's oh, coming, it's coming. Okay, you wanna okay. get your your, okay, your moment bad. to talk okay. about me? Okay. Next question. What is something on my bucket list? Um one of many. But you have to get this one that I'm thinking. Oh my god. How could I forget it? What's something on your bucket list? You don't know? It's fine. Me, Beyonce. <laughs> no, that's not what I'm thinking. Uh, uh, and, and the answer is a trip to Greece. Oh my God. Santorini. Oh. You know that this Euro trip oh, is something that we want to do. So that's very surprising. That was weird. That was weird. But it's okay. Oh it's okay. God, you win some, you lose some. Next question, you ready? 
What was my first official job? First official. You were a counselor? Yeah. Counselor. He gets that. Counselor. Ding, ding. Okay, this is a good one. What is my love language? Oh, physical touch. <laughs> We're a little far right now, but okay. Uh, bonus. <laughs> Stop. Bonus. Bonus question. What's the other one? Because I have, I would say I have two solid ones. No, I feel like they're all like your love language. I, feel like, I mean, I feel like you got three, three solid. Ones. Three. Okay, so I spit them so. out. Spit them out. Touch, um, uh, gifts. What's all of them? Just physical touch, gifts, active service, quality time, and words of affirmation, words of ethics, you know. Um, <laughs> what? <laughs> Why you say that so confidently? Uh, I would say physical touch, I think active service, and gifts. Okay. It's kind of hard not to have all of them, though, right? But yeah, I like but. Three, your three of them. You, you know the ones that I reiterate the most. I don't know. They're all like. Really? All of them. Like quality time. I just feel like I need somebody to help you. That's active, active service. service yes. Okay. So you get it. You get both points. So he gets the point for physical touch and he gets the bonus point for acts of service. You're good. You know me. What is my go to cocktail drink? A lemon drop martini. Okay. Anything else? Sugar rim. Okay. Oh, sugar rim. You gotta top it off. Sugar rim me, please. She's trying to like, she's trying to like make you work for every yeah. single point. Yeah. Like, I get that exact. Cause you have to, three years, you have to know me. Lemon drop martini. You okay, ought to know to me. ask my questions. Okay. Oof, okay. Yeah, That's fine. Just remember that. Okay, next question. What was my nickname growing Nelly. up? <laughs> <laughs> Nelly. Nelly. You you take me back by just saying that. Ooh. It's going down, down, baby. It's Not down, that Nelly, baby. but okay. Okay, what's my new nickname? Bonus is bonus. Coco? <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Coco. <clears throat> what did you tell me the other day? Duke gonna tell me I'm not Coco, I'm more caramel. I said that. You said you said that. You said oh, you yeah, more cocoa than me. I said yeah. I said man, you're not even dark skin. You're like caramel, you're like caramel color. Anyways, I'm chocolate, chocolate girl. I'm not part of this game, y'all. <laughs> I'm part of this, this what? chocolate game, y'all. Hey, Boy, hey, bye. Hey, you a chocolate gang member? Drop a chocolate bar in the comments. Right we both now. chocolate, baby. We well, don't know what you're if talking you about. If you chocolate, drop chocolate bars in the comments. Anyways, I'm telling you, she ain't chocolate. Anyways. Moving along, what is my favorite physical feature of yours? Um. <laughs> you stop it! <laughs> Are you serious? What? That was gross. Don't make me change my mind. <laughs> my lips. Oh my gosh. Okay, you got that. I have a bonus on this you. one. What's up? My bonus is, what is my favorite personality trait of yours? My favorite personality trait of mine? Um, can I just spit a couple out because I'm patient? Okay. I'm consistent. Still waiting for the one that I wrote. It's a bonus, right? Yeah, it's okay if you don't get this last one. That you're a very direct, no-nonsense kind of guy. I like yeah. that. That's probably. I, I, wasn't get there. I just don't want to give myself that much credit. Uh, you don't get that bonus point, Duke. Okay? <laughs> so you get, get one for the physical feature, you don't get the bonus though. I Great job, get, kiddo. I don't want to give myself that Great much job. Credit. Great job, Munchie. If you guys ever hear me call Duke Munchie, why you call me Munchie? That's my nickname for him. And if you are new to this channel, the reason why I call him Munchie is because. He's so munchable. I just want to munch on him. You're a little far away right now. But I'll munch on you later. Um, next question. When I was a child, what did I want to be when I grew up? When I grow up, I want to be famous. You want to be a fashion designer. 
That's the answer. Right? But you here, got it. Here's another answer. You want to be a video vixen. No. <laughs> that would have been... Wow. Yo, lying, you really I, did that? You really doing lying? that right now? So, yeah. She wanted to be a fashion Oh, my gosh. Nah, that, keep, keep, it, keep it real. Like, no, that wants, was not on the top of my list. That was like... That was going to be like my side hustle yeah, look, thing. Look, she wanted to be a fashion designer. Yes. But she also was like... Had this infatuation with being a video vixen because she wanted to be a girl. It's like give all the attention okay. and like this all super focused and you know like because video vixen it was hot back then listen know? if you guys grew up who was your favorite i, I was born vixen? in the 90s i don't know if i had a favorite like that i can remember the name mm -hmm. but i remember seeing beautiful chocolate women in these videos and like seeing girls on king magazine and i just thought they were so fire um, <laughs> y'all are probably gonna judge the hell out of know. me y'all remember king <laughs> magazine right y'all remember king magazine <laughs> Y'all remember what those oh, Y'all remember what those covers look like. <laughs> I remember I had them shits King, in my phone. King magazine without the ass on the cover. Okay? Is okay, there even tasteful. a King magazine without yes, the ass yes, on the cover? Yes, yes, yes. There is. That's like essence. Anyways, that was a very short moment in my life where I was like, oh, I want to do that one day. I want to be in like a Neo video or something like that. A Usher video. You know, you can't really judge anyone's like... <laughs> aspirations as a kid you know dude I mean? dude please can't i like, can't believe he drew he drew that <laughs> one out but it is what it is it's all good you get the point for fashion designer what was the name of the graduate school that i graduated from suny downstate suny albany downstate <laughs> what hold on hold on, hold on. No, 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 oh. no 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 okay no 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 okay Okay, so we, okay, yeah, so we, so we downstate, yes. So what is it? Final answer? Stop dragging this. I just said it, right? SUNY what? <laughs> SUNY downstate medical. Okay. Okay, SUNY downstate medical. Jeez, you're gonna say it, say it with your chest. <laughs> say it confidently, SUNY Ooh. downstate medical center. Ooh. Graduated from there. Shout out to SUNY downstate. Where's our mascot? What? Where's our mascot? Was it was mascot? grad school. I don't think there was a mascot thing. Wait. SUNY Albany is where I got my undergrad. I could not tell you what the mascot is. I was not into sports. I don't know. I'm a school pride. <laughs> I, was, I was a nerd in school, okay? I was not worried about nobody's mascot, sports, nothing. What year did I start my fitness journey? 2016. Um, okay, and bonus question, do you want? What month? You started your fitness journey in uh, May. Ding, ding. 2016. Oh, you're good. Oof. You're, you're, you got, you're like down only two. Everything else you got. Okay, 26, May 2016, he's right. What are some hidden talents that many people don't know about me? Some hidden uh, talents that I have that many people don't know. Oh yeah, yeah. She's really good at sewing. So she's been sewing since like she got her sew. You got your machine at ten years old, but you probably started sewing earlier than that, right? No. Yeah. Uh, well, I first got introduced to the idea of sewing at yeah. nine. Okay. So yeah, ten. So so she can sew, right? She has a fashion design background, so she can make clothes. That's a lot. That's something a lot of people don't know. Yeah, good answer, babe. What else can I do? Um, she can um <laughs> Stop it! Stop uh, Next question. I'm not even playing with you. That's not what I was going for. No. What is my biggest <laughs> Yeah, she's really good. Okay, you can deduct you get points deducted too. Play with me if you want. What is my biggest fear? Um, <laughs> this is crazy. Everything, <laughs> everything, 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 everything. You're afraid of everything. <laughs> no. Every really? single. No, really? No, 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 no. So seriously, no. She is afraid of a lot of things, but I think that her biggest fear is heights. Yes. Right? She's heights. Like 
water swimming. She can't swim. <laughs> Anything that has to do with water, she's like super nervous. That's another one that I, pro that's probably equivalent to heights. Heights. The water thing. Right, she's just now getting over a fear of driving. So that's what he means when he says I'm afraid of everything because, <clears throat> you know, growing up in Brooklyn, I used to just play at the sprinklers. <laughs> so I remember we were in Tulum 2018. All right, we talked about this on one of our previous videos, but we were out there just on vacation. And, you know, they have, if you've ever been to Loon, they have like a strip where you can ride bikes, you know? So I'm trying to do just like cool stuff, romantic stuff on her. I'm like, yo, let's ride some bikes. And she's like, uh. I said, what's wrong with bikes? You don't like with bikes? She was like, I don't, I haven't ridden a bike in so long. I was like, it's, it's okay, it's just a bike. You know, you don't, you don't need it, no problem. She was super nervous and super scared, and I had like literally forced her to get on the bike. Even when she got on the bike, she was putting on like a little old lady. <laughs> so, like a little old lady. Scared of mm. everything. Scared of everything. Okay, when we cross that bridge, how many baby kids do I want? <laughs> <laughs> Don't call my kids. Baby. <laughs> <laughs> I can do it. I can say that now. Let's get, let's get that. Fair. Do not call my kids baby kids. All right. But to answer your question, you want one kid. One. You don't want to go through that process again. Uno. You want one. Who know? And you want a girl. All I right? do. You really want like a little mini Chanel to go to the mall <laughs> with, go grocery shopping with, just be a little mini me tag along. <laughs> You sound like you're stressed already. <laughs> so you want Wouldn't one. you want that? A mini me? A mini me. A mini you. Yeah. Another one. <laughs> Another one. A smaller one. No. <laughs> Another but, one. But uh but yeah, one kid. One kid. One and done. You got that point. Okay. What is my favorite cheat meal? You're gonna get this. So easy. Uh, pizza. Pizza, pizza. She's a pizza head. Yes, can we fly to New York to get pizza? New York pizza head. No, we just got back from New York. Can we do it? Um, I'll think about it. <laughs> He's a I'll, liar. I'll think about liar. it, Liar! What is my favorite genre of music to listen to in the gym? Uh, you like to listen to uh, rap and hip hop. And yes. Yeah. Okay. A lot of pop smoke, a lot of Nicki Minaj. But who's my favorite? This is the bonus question. Who's my absolute favorite? Who am I gonna turn on right away in the gym? Nicki Minaj. Yeah. Nicki Minaj, for sure. Nicki, Nicki, Nicki. Yeah. Hey, Nicki, if you're watching this. <laughs> How do you know when I'm upset or having a bad day? What's the telltale uh, sign? Like. How do I know when you're upset or having a bad day? I know you're upset. I say, what's up? I text you, what's up, babe? You say, hey. Or you say something like, you just not friendly with the text message. You're right? super short, super cold. I'm talking uh, about in person, not the text. I'm trying to give you all No, 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 no. no we, we don't need to give all angles of me. I'm trying, I'm trying, I thought we was talking, I thought I was answering the question, y'all. Okay, well, there's one answer that's only gonna get you the so, right. So, I also know that you're upset because you're quiet, I, like you're just, <laughs> you're just quiet, waiting for me to say like, what's wrong? <laughs> you're this quiet. Is <laughs> this is true. You're quiet, you're quiet, you just be like, yo, in your head you be thinking like, I'm waiting for him to ask what's wrong. No, 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 no. I, I, be, I, I, I keep quiet uh, to help me. It's like putting the, the, the pot over the tea kettle, like just keeping all of the fumes inside. <laughs> so I just be quiet because I don't got nothing nice to say when I'm upset. So I just be quiet. I'm helping you out. Yeah, so she be quiet. She be walking around the house. <laughs> <laughs> you seem very amused by my uh, uneasiness. Anyways. Uh, uh, wait, that's right. Yes, you're right. Okay. The answer was that I get very quiet. So you get that point. We got a bonus on this. What usually cheers me up? It's something that you do that cheers me up. Acai bowl? Yes. Yeah, I get her acai well, bowl. Pretty much like him offering me some sort of like treat. Like you want me to get you something? Like you want me to get you something to make you feel better? 
the easiest thing is like an acai bowl. Ice cream or chips. Chips. Like something sweet. <laughs> something sweet. Something tasty. Something sweet. Or even just like something like some I'll bring home, maybe like if it's a Friday, if I bring home like some chicken or something like she'd be like. Okay. <laughs> yeah, those are the something things that excite me something right now. Yes. Good, good job. Are we at the last one? We are at the last question. Jamie, how many did I get wrong so far? Okay. <laughs> Jamie said he this. got two wrong. Jamie, Jamie said this. He got two. He got two wrong, guys. Right. Two wrong out of twenty-five. All right. So this is you one you're gonna get. I asked you too much easy question. What is my favorite holiday? Um, your birthday. <laughs> no. Your birthday. No, that does not count. That does not count. No, your favorite holiday is. It's Christmas. Christmas was like pretty big in New York though, right? Just like the- Yeah, the, the snow yeah, yeah, yeah. and so, everything. So Christmas though, yeah, for sure. Yeah, I will say that out here in LA, Christmas feels very weird. Different. Yeah, it feels different because it's no snow. Yeah. Um, so I'm still getting used to that, but I feel like I have to do a lot more to get into the holiday spirit because it's like, it's not cold outside. There's no snow. So I did tell you the other day that like, I'm gonna go get some decorations for the house, you know. Good job, you got 23 right out of 25. Ooh. And it's okay because I'm gonna get 25 out of 25. All right, listen baby, if anybody can do it, you can. Mm, I know that's right. All right. Let me tell y'all something. All right, the type of fire that I spit is different. Babe, hold on, this hold on, is hold on, not hold on, about... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. See, you, you took me here. She, she brought, <laughs> now we're here. She brought us here. Listen. <laughs> hey, listen. I met her at a bar. I said, hey, yo, I came here just for you. I told her exactly what I... I said, yo, I saw you on Instagram. I saw you on the Explore page. And I came here just for you. And I went and got her and brought her ass back to LA. Listen, Hold this on. is, this is wait, wait, wait. That's not the type of fire, <laughs> and that fire ain't blazing. Listen, babe, babe, heard you, heard you. If you guys haven't already saw the video on how we met, please get caught up right now. Watch the video on how we met. Also watch the video on how we reconnected. And just watch it all. Also, this be a great time for you guys to go ahead and subscribe or yes, comment or like. Yes. Um, in the comments down below right now, right now, right now, right now. Yes, if you right. are enjoying this video, also let us know because I'm having a good time. Same. All right, I'm you ready? Fine. Yes. You ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, hold on, hold on. All right, let's do it. I'm ready. Question number one. What high school did I go to? Sarah. Okay, okay, correct. What's my favorite exercise to do in the gym? Um, squats, back squats, and Russian twists. Okay. Barbell squats and Russian twists. Okay, correct. Next. Okay. Ooh, she feel like confident. Easy. She feel like confident. Easy money, easy okay. money. Okay. Uh, what's the first meal I cook for you? Spaghetti. What's my favorite fast food restaurant? Um, Popeyes. Okay. This shit's too easy. Nah, I just know you. Okay, how many I get right? You forgot? I, okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> Don't worry about it. All right, what round did I get drafted into the NFL? What round? Uh -huh. What do you mean round? What round did I get drafted into the NFL? Like what year? What round did I get drafted? Okay, to be fair, I don't know what rounds is. What round? Did I get drafted into the NFL? What round? Well, yeah. I know you were undrafted. Okay. Does that mean okay, so round? It doesn't even matter what round. Oh. Oh. Because I wasn't drafted. Okay. Okay. So, okay, I'll give you that. Okay. okay. What round? What round? <laughs> what round? <laughs> doesn't matter. <laughs> Next question. Uh, what is the date? We first met the date the date like the the month the day the and date, the year the date the date <laughs> and yes the date uh i know it was 2017 uh -huh. and i know it was 
It was late May, early July. Late May. I mean, it, <laughs> late May, early June. What did, what did late June May, go? early June. Okay. So I want to say it was June. It was June 2017. The date, I'm going to just say it was like June 5th. Okay. What was it? What was it? Well, okay, what did I get wrong? June 2nd is the answer. Okay, I was close. I could get like half a point because <coughs> I got part of the answer. No. No. No, no, no. What? No, no, that's an exact. First of all, a date is an exact answer. You got the date wrong, baby. Okay. Okay. Next question. What is a hidden talent of mine that many people don't know about? Oh, that's easy. That you're very tech savvy. He's very like com computer geek guy. Mm -hmm. And you're very handy. Mm -hmm. You know how to use them hands, boy. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Like around the house. Around the house. <laughs> <laughs> around the house, okay, correct, correct. All right. I'm doing great. <laughs> What is my full middle name? I know Uba. Uba, right? Uh-huh. Chidi Uba? Oba. 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 Chidi Oba. Is it Chiji Oba? Yeah. Chiji Oba. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Chiji Oba. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Put your tongue back. <laughs> <laughs> what is that one there, man? How's a nickname like Chiji Oba around you? Yeah, Chiji Oba. <laughs> yeah, yeah, what's my nickname? Chicho Bob. That's not what I meant. <laughs> no, that's not. That was like L. Like, you know, you were like L. I got it. <laughs> no, not Chicho Bob, bro. But your tongue, I was not aroused by your middle name. <laughs> what? That, I was just being a chicken head. All right, cool. Next question. <laughs> what's one thing on my bucket list? One thing on your bucket list. I know that we have a lot of travel bucket list things. Um, travel, you want to travel somewhere mm -hmm. that you've never been. Mm -hmm. Eurotrip or Eurotrip. Did I get this question wrong too for you? Yes, you said, yes, I got Greece wrong. Yes. Are you about to get this wrong too? No. Are you about to get this wrong, babe? No, no, no. I'm getting there. Okay. Relax. You want to go to travel in <laughs> You want to travel. Okay. Um, I know you want, I know a Euro trip. That would be my final answer. Okay. Wrong. Okay. Great Wall of China. What? Great Wall of China. That's new. Great Wall of well, China. Okay, we learn something new every day. Great Wall of China. Bucket list, y'all, bucket list. Okay. I, I could take that. What? That's too wrong. Two. What Two was my nickname? You can't get one more wrong, you know that? Ooh, it's getting spicy. What? Well, you're not throwing any bonuses in for me. Hey, take all my bonuses out. All the bonus points I got, you can take it out. Yeah, it's not gonna matter. <laughs> hey. What was my nickname as a kid? Duke Smooth. Mm. Why they call you? I don't even know. Because I guess you thought I, you was... <laughs> no, they called you Duke Smooth because you were smooth? You're yeah. a smooth kind of guy. You think I'm smooth? Huh? You heard me. <laughs> nah, I think you smooth. I think if I was a guy, I would want to be like Duke, so... Okay. You smooth. I appreciate that. I fuck with it. Okay. Uh, correct. Next question, next question. Now... What's my favorite drink to order when we're out? Easy money, easy. <laughs> Grand Marier on the rocks. Okay, okay, I'll give you that one. That was easy, babe. Next question, what 
was my first tattoo. Your first tattoo of the many tattoos that you have and they cannot see it right now. Um, I think it was the lion okay. on your arm. Okay, what arm was it? Is that a bonus? That's a bonus, what arm was it? <laughs> your left arm. Okay. Correct. <laughs> no, it's right. Correct. This is right. Okay. Okay, so I got the regular point, just not the bonus point. That's fine. Okay, okay. What is my love language? Your love language is quality time. Okay, correct. That's easy. That's an easy one. All right. You probably don't get this. Let's I know see. you, baby. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What did my parents want me and my brothers to be growing up? Oh, that's easy. We just spoke about this. Okay. We just had a conversation about this. They wanted you to be a doctor. Mm -hmm. A doctor. A doctor. <laughs> Carl to be a lawyer. Mm -hmm. a and lawyer. Glenn to be an engineer. An engineer. True Nigerian parents. He said, dude, you'll be a doctor. <laughs> Carl would be a lawyer. <laughs> Glenn would be an engineer. <laughs> No. Oh, I, I feel like I said this to you in our conversation that we just had. Duke gives me more lawyer vibes. Mm, I feel like you would I'm so be, combative. Yes. What town am I from in Nigeria? Orlu Town. Orlu Town. We about town. to go to Nigeria. Orlu Town Union, boy, Umafo, Imo State. Imo okay, Fungo. rep your set. Drop a Nigerian flag in the comments. Next question. What's my favorite body part on you? My waist? No. What? No. Uh, I'm going to let you try that again because you was being lazy with that. What's my favorite body part on you? Okay, okay. I just didn't want to say it. My booty. Yo, booty. <laughs> what you called it one time? Rotund? Oh, <laughs> I said that. Yeah, yeah, that's a rotund. <laughs> You nasty. Uh, what's my favorite thing to say to you when I'm mad at you? Oh, this is easy. Whoa. Yo, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? And you do the hand. What are you talking about? <laughs> Scrunch up your face. What are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? What the f are you talking about? Sometimes you call the Chanel bro when I'm mad. Bro? I'd be like, bro, what are you talking about, bro? <laughs> Man. Yeah. Yeah, correct, correct, correct. Okay, what's my favorite movie? Your favorite movie is. Troy. Mm, okay, bonus question. Correct. Troy is correct. Bonus question. What's my favorite genre of movies? You like. Um, like action movies. Yeah, but more specifically. Um. Hmm. Action. No, you're Drama right. action? Drama action. I know you so, like a lot of like, drug movies. Who doesn't like drug movies? We all like drug What's movies. What's the, is that a, that's not Say a no genre drugs. though. <laughs> drug, street crime? Street crime, crime. crime. like crime. Yeah. yeah. Okay. But uh, yeah, you're right, Troy. But I also like 300, I also like Gladiator. Those are like those uh, medieval, I don't want to say medieval, but those like old mm -hmm. type of movies. Yeah. Next question. We're almost done. What's my favorite TV show? Your favorite TV show is Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones. Correcto. All right. Wow, I, I know you. All right, what do I want all to myself in my dream home? A man cave. Why do I want a man cave? I mean, I don't know why because I'm going to visit there too. I want a man cave. So you could do what? I want a man cave. So I have my space where there's no trespassers. <laughs> I'm not a trespasser in our home. So that sounds like a personal problem. The rules is the rules. Listen, you can come in my beauty room and I'm gonna come in your man cave from Who? time to time. Why would I ever wanna come in your beauty room? I don't know, you might wanna steal some ideas about how I'm gonna set it up. 
That's my idea. <laughs> do you? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> okay, correct. The next one is, what other city would I live besides LA? Stick to your gut. <laughs> I'm so tempted to say New York because I'm from New York. But I know as much as you don't want to admit it, I know that you do not enjoy the cold in New York and you could never survive it. First of all, I can survive everywhere. Listen, you lived in New York for a period of time, but you can't live there ongoing. First of all, let's, let's be get, honest. Let's get that straight. I could, I could survive anywhere. Okay. But I'll let you finish your question. Answer. My, fine, with that said, I'm saying that my answer would be Atlanta because it's a good middle ground. Um, it's not too cold, I think. Uh -huh. It's not too hot. It's in the middle of the, you know. Yeah. The setup. Yeah. I like black people. In the space. Yeah. I like and, black the, people. and there's space there. You could buy a home, yeah. a nice big home. Yeah, yeah. So. It seems like the black community out there is just cool. Yeah. And, I, and I know she would like it too, so. I'm, you trying to move to ATL? No. <laughs> but yeah, you're you really got, an LA boy. You got, you got the right answer, correct, correct. You're right. really an LA boy. Um, how many kids do I want? I would say you want two, a boy or girl. Boy and a girl. In an ideal world, a boy yeah, and a girl. because I, I would have to agree to that. Yeah. But when it's time for the kids to come, if we get a boy on the first time, and she says I only want one kid, I'm good with that. I promise you, I'm good with that. <laughs> but if we get a girl first, then I'm think I'm gonna pressure her for one more. I'm gonna put that pressure on her. So, but yeah, she's right. Two kids. These are not pressuring me, babe. He's, I don't yeah, know what he's Yeah, but a boy, a boy is something that I think I want, though. So that's something that I'll probably be like, hey, babe, look. Yeah, in terms of like carrying your name out, yes. right? Yeah, yeah, that's like, that's a serious thing. Next question. What year <laughs> did I cross into my fraternity? I'm an alpha, y'all. So. Can so. I say it the way I say it? The way I think y'all say it? Oh, nine? <laughs> oh nine. Oh nine. You two, you crossed the twenty thousand nine. Two thousand and nine. Two thousand nine. And this this video will be posted after this day. But happy alpha anniversary, oh. baby. Happy Founders Day. Oh, that's, is it called Alphaversary though? It's Founders Day, but it's a thought that counts. Today is the So what's your Alphaversary? My Alphaversary is the day that I crossed into my fraternity. Oh, Today okay. is the day that my, 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 my fraternity was founded, December 4th, 1906. Okay. Okay, so shout out to all the Alphas watching this right now. If you are an Alpha, if you're, um, uh, if you're Greek in general, right? If you have any kind of um, lineage that's a good with word. Alpha. Just go ahead and drop a comment right now. Let us know where you're from. Let us know what organization you're from. If you're in fraternity or sorority, wrap your set, man. Drop your that set. down. Right. I'm not in a sorority. But if you could have joined, you would have been. But there. if I could have joined, I would have been an AKA. Mm -hmm. Okay, so she said, she was correct though. She said, oh, nine. How do you say it though? It's, oh, six. <laughs> One, 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 nine. <laughs> oh, six. One more. Hey, five. <laughs> what am I afraid of? Um, I would say that you are most afraid of just not reaching your fullest potential. Yeah. You're very like goal oriented and whenever you work so hard to make sure you reach whatever goals you are working towards in life. So you just are afraid of failing. Yeah. Yeah. Facts. Last question. What artist did I used to play when we used to do <laughs> grown folks Business Why when we are first you met. asking me this question? We used to do the grown folk business when we oh first met. Oh my god, this is Ooh. so triggering. <laughs> this is triggering because I felt like it was a playlist that was rotated. <laughs> Anyways, this is your truth. 
Yes, it was Trey Songz. <laughs> Duke was always playing a Trey Songz playlist when we were being intimate. And I'm pretty sure a few people have heard that playlist. But it's okay, because that playlist is no longer in use. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. It was a good playlist, though. Yeah. I'll bet the name was no more <laughs> Please don't. Don't start. People think I am any sex. It was like one of those cliche, one? like, why are we listening to Trey songs right now? Done. So, <laughs> I won. <laughs> Okay, that's it, that's it, that's it. Um, I think you got three wrong. We'll tally it up. It was two, I'm pretty sure it was like two, just like you, it might okay. be a tie. Okay, it might be a tie. What y'all think? Drop in the comments, who won? Did Chanel win or <laughs> did Duke win? Uh, listen, I think you did a good job. I wasn't expecting you to get as many answers as you got. Ooh. So I'm proud of you. Thank you, baby. I wish there was a way to do more detailed questions, but a lot of detailed questions are a lot more like subjective and they're not such facts. They're not fact based. Yeah, that's more, those are more like story. Mm -hmm, like story just telling about our experience. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think uh, I wish I had the tally right now, but I don't. And I think I was just enjoying it so much that I just forgot to keep count. Yes. And um, but let's, if just, let's, just say, let's just say that we tied. We tied? Let's just say we tied. So there's no way. I want to win. Damn. Guess we got to count them up. <laughs> I, I, you guys need to well, count well, count well, it up and let us know in the comments who won. Well, and then we'll go back and forth about our wager. Well, one thing is for sure. I know I didn't lose. I don't it's think either I, we tied or you lost. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I er, know that. Er. I know that. If you guys enjoyed this video, this little Q&A quiz vibe that we got going on, please make sure you like this video right now. Comment down below. Let us know if you had as much of a good time watching it Absolutely. as we did filming this video for you guys. And as always, let us know what video you would like to see next. We love you guys. I think we are at 30K subscribers around there on YouTube. Oh. So, so let's get those numbers up, man. We're going to we yes. keep climbing. We're doing a great job, mm -hmm. guys. And thanks for being part of the family, man. We enjoy CD you guys. Fam. And I hope you guys are enjoying everything that we're about. Yeah. All right. Yes. So until next time, guys, peace.